What's poppin' YouTube? It's your girl Jay, and I'm back to pop my sh again. So what's up, you guys? It's been a long time, no see, since I've done one of these videos, but we just gonna get straight into it. Make sure you guys follow me on all socials. Also follow out loud on all socials. Everything will be in the description box below. Hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. Also, do not forget to leave this video a big, big like and a huge, huge spam in the comments, please. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. And welcome to the channel. If you are new here, I am Jay. And if y'all return a subscriber, what's up? You guys click this title because you guys want to know a step-by-step -step guide to have the best. And when I say the best, I mean the best glow up of 2024. So without further ado, let's get into these steps. I'm going to categorize these steps into five pretty much categories. Um, and this is what we're going to be working on for the year of 2024 and before i get into this what i want to say is i strongly encourage you guys start doing this now do not wait until the new year do not wait until it's january 1st 2024 no you can start right here in october of 2023 make these last three months make fourth quarter count so the first thing we're going to work on to have the best glow up of 2024 for the new year is our body now let me give you guys a quick backstory so my weight always tend to fluctuate so i've always been an active person i cheered for 10 years can't help but to be active right um with that being said i know how to get up i know how to go to the gym i did have my moments where i was slip but once i noticed i was slipping for too long i got me a trainer this summer he pushed me right back into the gym and i only was went to him for a month and this was back in june or july and i've been consistently going to the gym ever since i'm also doing a two-week food and water detox fast so i'm health is wealth number one and when you want to get your body right, you have to, you have to just jump out and do it. I know we say, oh, it's going to be the new year. I'm going to be a gym girly. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. No, you want to start now. So when the new year comes around, it's already implemented into your routine. Because usually what happens is people say they're going to be in a gym, say they're going to get their body right for the summer. But really, you could have just started now. you got to get your health in order. You have to know how to diet and fast from certain things. Um, I'm also not drinking liquor right now at the moment. I'm not drinking liquor. Nope. I am taking every step and every initiative to stay in alignment with getting my health in order. Um, I'm not saying you got to go full on pescatarian or vegan or just do food uh, for, you know, a month. I'm not saying you got to do that, but do what you have to do to to get a diet, get get you a good diet, meal prep if you have to. You don't have to cut out all the way, but you know what you need to be cutting back. You know you gotta cut out some of that bread, some of them fried foods. Cut it on back, but you don't have to do it all at once. Start by meal prepping, okay? Working out, like I said in one of my TikTok videos, you guys just have to do it. When you wanna get into the gym, you cannot think about it. Because you sitting there trying to think about it, you're not gonna do it. So you have to, and I mean, you have to, you have to, have to implement it into your routine some kind of way, even if you go for a walk. If you don't do the gym, cool, go for a walk or a run. If you do do the gym, the best way I like to do the gym, I like to go in the morning right when I wake up. So I don't even think about it. As soon as I get up from the bed, I get myself together, put on my gym clothes, I'm out the door, I'm headed to the gym. And you ain't even got to stay for a long time. I do for about an hour, hour and a half now since I've been kind of you know getting into it but do what you got to do don't even time yourself in the gym set you a routine you know i'll insert some examples right here set your routine of what you're going to do in the gym so you know as soon as you get into the gym this is what i'm going to be tackling today i'm going to get some cardio in you know five minutes of cardio to jump kick off my you know heart rate then i'm going to move on into abs i might be feeling a little strong that day so i might want to do arms or i might want to work out my core have you a set routine and set ways you want to do it so when it's time for you to go to the gym you already know what you're doing and just don't think about it just go sign up if that helps you just go ahead and pay for the gym pay for it in advance if you have to okay just sign up also want to be consistent and disciplined in the gym and the only way to do that is just by doing it. that's the first thing you want to do to get the best glow up of 2024 Get your health in order. Get that body right. 
eat good, drink your water, hydrate. The next thing you want to do to have the best glow up in 2024 is you want to improve your mental health. You can do this by reading, listening to positive music, positive podcasts such as me or positive people such as me. Also going to therapy. Improving your mental health will help you in so many ways, y'all. I'm going to say this and this is just from my own personal experience. I'm not where I want to be just yet. But I thank God for where I'm at just because I am at such peace mentally. Like mentally, I feel like I'm, I can do anything. I feel on top of the world because why I took some time away from everything and everybody, I blocked out all the noise so I can focus on me and, and what I had going on in here. When you get this right, I'm telling you all things is going to fall in line after that. This getting this right up here, this mind, your mindset, changing your mindset, changing the way you think, the way you speak and all of that type of stuff, getting your mental health and just um, your emotional health, your spiritual health, getting healthy in the inside, I'm telling you, will start to show in your outside once you're right within. Um, what what um what the song say? How you gonna win if you ain't right within? For real, like if you want to be a good person and have the best life and glow up, you ha it starts within. It starts with yourself. Um, don't be listening to I love me a good sexy red song. I love I love looking for the mm, yeah yeah shake that. I love it. I'm telling you, I do. But I know when to turn it off and put on me a good little sermon from Sarah Jakes Roberts. You want to listen to good, positive things to keep you in that uh, mind space. I'm also reading Atomic Habits right now. Uh, I was supposed to been finished this book, but y'all, to be honest, whatever I, to be honest the little bit i did read so far in this book has motivated me enough let's make sure you guys are also reading books reading good books that will um help align you and get you back in alignment and pray get a get a closer relationship with god please it's so much stuff going on in this world it's so much stuff like you want to stay prayed up i'm telling you build your relationship with god improve your mental health listen to positive people and positive things read positive books, staying in alignment will definitely help you. I'm telling you, you get this right, you can do anything. The next thing you want to do to have the best glow up in 2024 is you want to improve yourself socially. Now, hear me out. You've got to change up your environment, okay? It's cool to go to the nightclubs and, you know, stand on the section, shake your tail feather. I get it. I'm still young and turned too, you feel me? But it's going to come... A place in your life where you want to see some type of change so you have to change your environment you have to change where you go to it's okay to still go out and network and um because let's just be real you ain't networking in a club it's shots get past left left right you smoking hookah you ain't networking in the club you ain't networking in the club go to a speakeasy lounge you know, places where, you know, everyone is sitting down, you know, they kind of mingling, you know, after um after everybody get off work, it's happy hour at the bars. Go there. Change up your environment. Um, also try doing different things that you don't normally do. Um, I did not do yoga. Now I love yoga. I haven't made it to Pilates stage yet because I love the gym and I just Pilates is cool. I do want to get into Pilates, but I definitely love the gym. I feel like Pilates is a good alternative if you're not a gym girly, but you still want to get right and, you know, try Pilates. Do things that you don't normally do. Meditate. I don't like being outside, but y'all, I've been finding so much joy in going on walks and runs because I'm changing up my environment. I'm changing up my routine you do change your environment and you start doing stuff you wouldn't normally do guess what happens you're changing the people that you interact with because your home girl that go out every weekend is probably not the home girl that's at church go to church go to go back to church get you some church friends changing up your social life will definitely help improve your glow up not saying you have to turn cold to the people you once were cool with or the people that are in your past, but you definitely want, a, want to set a standard for your future. 
The fourth thing you're going to do to glow up for 2024 is improve your appearance. Okay. Ensure you're staying up to par with your hair, your nails. Um, change up your makeup routine, change up your skincare routine, get good skincare products. Right now, y'all, my face is breaking out and I have no idea why. So guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to go take my little stuff to Target. We're going to get some new skincare products and we're going to change this routine. I also want to change up my makeup routine. I change up my makeup routine pretty much um, every year anyways. Um, so doing things like that, um, getting nicer clothes. Um, one thing that I had, and I'm gonna expose myself right now. One thing that I definitely want to do starting for 2024 is stop wearing the same stuff over and over again. I am the type of person where I wear some once, so I don't want to wear it again. Something like this I would, cause it's just kind of chill, but I don't like having just stuff that I've accumulated over the years. So it's a lot of things in my closet right now that needs to get thrown away baby it's about to be torn in a second if i keep wearing it so i need to go get rid of it and get some new clothes update your wardrobe um improving your appearance will overall help you because when you look better you feel better okay when you look good you feel good um once i'm you know all put together i got my makeup on i got my hair laid i got my nails done oh i could go anywhere and so guess what i'm doing i'm going to these places i've never been before and then guess what i'm doing I'm networking, I'm meeting new people. Then guess what I'm doing? I'm improving my social, I'm improving my mental health by changing up my environment socially. You see how everything just flow in together? I know being a girl and you know, I've seen the topic on TikTok. I know being a girl can get expensive sometimes. It is a lot to keep your hair and nails done. Baby, go to that beauty supply store. Press homes, eight, ten dollars. You can even go to Family Dollar and get you something for four dollars. Trust me, I've been there before. Now this was a, a hundred dollar nail set, and I don't have a hundred dollars every time to pay for my nails. So when I can't, you know, pay a hundred dollars for my nails, I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store, but I'm still gonna make sure I have something on my nails. So it's not about exactly spending the most money to look the best. It's about doing what you can to look the best. Okay. Also, going to the beauty supply store, getting you some pack hair if you can't afford nice bundles or um, going to um, get you a little braided ponytail. I used to slick my stuff up. You got to acquire your beauty skills. I talked about this on my TikTok. Make sure you guys follow me on TikTok if you do not follow me because I talked about this. Acquiring skills in the beauty industry will help you save so much more money because I do my own hair. I do my own makeup. I even learned how to do my own lashes. Making sure you keep yourself up beauty wise will overall help you just in general. Cause like I said, you look good, you feel even better. So make sure you guys are doing what you gotta do to look your best. And the last and final thing I wanna talk about, and this is what's really gonna tie everything in together. This is what's gonna help you have the best glow up. In 2024, you want to do this. You want to stay consistent, stay disciplined, and stay on your zoom stay on your routine okay um consistency and discipline is what can hurt a lot of people i have been in you know periods of my life where i wasn't the most consistent and i wasn't the most dis disciplined and it has hurt me see when the new year come around that's why i said start now so if you go ahead and start now with these last 90 days of the year by the time 2024 come come along oh you doing it you're doing it like clockwork now I'm telling you, everybody want to wait to January 1st. Oh, okay, I'm in the gym. Oh, okay, I'm going to start meal prepping. Oh, okay, I'm going to start here. I'm going to start now. I'm going to start, start at this time. I'm going to start at that time. No, because when you do that, when you don't just do it and you try to set a time to do it, you're eventually going to fall off. Now, you can say, okay, maybe right now isn't the perfect time and maybe I do want to get started in January. Hey, that's fine. You can do that. But when you start in January, you need to stay consistent. That means you need to change your routine. That means you need to improve your mental health. That means you need to stay consistent in the gym. That means you need to stay consistent on their diet. That means you need to stay consistent with changing up your environment. That means you, that means you need to stay consistent with meeting new people and networking with different people. You have to, you have to be consistent and disciplined. That's the only way that these steps are going to really work for you. Um, I will insert pictures right here 
to show y'all what I what improvements I made in two weeks, y'all. Two weeks. I did a full fast for two weeks. It'll be fully two weeks tomorrow, and I do and I went and I'm gonna weigh myself. But I have lost five pounds so far in the first week from this fast, and this is the before and this is the after. A complete difference. A complete difference just because I stay consistent and I stay disciplined. I'm not gonna lie, I want to see through board right now. I sure do. But I'm disciplined enough to know that if I want to see better results, I have to create better habits. So I have to eat better. I have to put better things into my body instead of the same old, same old, same old. So yes, you guys, these five things, improving your body, improving your mental health, changing up your environment, changing up who you socialize with and also staying consistent and creating a disciplined routine will definitely help you have the best glow up in 2024 wishing you guys many many blessings for this year and also next year also make sure you guys follow me on all social platforms for more tips because i do these type of videos a lot and yeah if i just want to see everyone win so i'm going to give you guys my tips and what works for me and hopefully you can apply those apply them to your life and you don't have to do exactly what i did but just doing those steps will definitely help you Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see y'all in the next one.